hey guys it is me rose idols so this is going to be that clothing haul video i was talking about um so it's going to be kind of weird because um i already opened some of the stuff before i left um back in june so yeah that's that stuff here and then some some of them are wearing some of the things so um there's that and then hold on. and then my cotton honey order i picked up today so those I haven't seen. So it's like I already, I've already seen these and haven't seen these. So um, you haven't seen any of them. So it's kind of like still going to be a surprise for you guys. But um, yeah, as for the shoes that was supposed to be in this clothing haul, um, one of them is down there. Um, if I feel like it, I'll get it later. Um, and then the other sh pair of shoes that um, I got, um, I did not like them. So I tossed them. Anyways, um, yeah, so without further ado, um, I'm gonna start, uh, so I'm just gonna, like, show you guys these, I honestly feel like I'm forgetting something, but I don't remember, okay, so, um, I did, um, was it? I did a clothing commission, uh, with Jointed Life, so, um, uh, I, well, these were something that they already made, but the, I'm gonna show you the commission uh, under this. Okay, right, so uh, I forgot what you call this, like a varsity jacket or something. Um, but yeah, this is like really nice. Like this is, this is really nice. This reminds me of like, um, like Darlene. Like you know, Darlene makes these types of um, um, outerwear, but like with a hood. Um, so yeah, and it's really silky, really good um, fabric. So, and the sleeves are leather. Oh, and there's pockets. So, I probably will put this on someone later, but not right now. I'm just showing everything. Yeah, so this is my favorite. I just love the pattern. It's really, really nice. Alright, so here's the actual commission. <clears throat> so, I already have um, denim jackets, but like, it was kind of like a fetish of mine a couple months ago. It still kind of is. So, um, I really wanted more. So, I commissioned uh, her him or her to make this black one and then I'll show you Takara really quick. Takara's wearing the blue one. Alright, and here's the blue one. So yeah. Uh I had to wash it though because um when I got it it smelled really strongly of bleach and I did not want to put it on any of them because I, I was afraid that it might have like you know damaged their clothing or whatever. But aside from that like it's a really good jacket. It's really um it looks like, how do I describe it? It looks like it's um, a real human size shrunk down. Like the stitching is really good. Um, I'm not like, I don't know how to make clothes, but like I, I wear clothes, so I could tell you like this is really nice. Um, and then the other um, thing that arrived was this hat that he has on. So um, I bought three of them. I bought that black one you just saw. I'll show you the other two in a second. Um, so my order kind of got ruined because I ordered a black and a white hat and then um, a gray one. So you just saw this one in black. I ordered a white, but they sent me a red, which I don't want. But I mean, they're out of white, so like there's nothing I can do. And then this one right here. So yeah. Um, so that's the hats. Um, so those are the stuff that I was saying that I already opened. So that's part of that. And then these three so I got these on um I got these on what did I get these on oh my gosh my memory part what is that website called Aliexpress okay yeah sorry I haven't been shopping in a while you guys so these are just basic like really basic um sweaters I just got plain color and I'm not gonna do anything to them usually like when I get like stuff, stuff plain like this you know I like put patches or designs or something on it but um, I actually got these to be plain to be worn um, underneath the denim jackets so yeah that's why I got those so if I could show you really quickly so I'm not gonna actually um, I'm not gonna actually tuck the sleeves through but I'll just fold it so you can kind of see what I mean So, like that, like a hoodie underneath the dome. That's what I got this for. So, yeah. 
Okay, I'm gonna put these to the side now. Okay, also what came with the order was some socks. I did not order these, um, she sent them. So, she sent some really nice socks. Um, these are like sushi creatures or something, I don't know. It's like a lobster and a squid or octopus or something, and like a hammerhead shark or something. But yeah, they're really cute. And ever since I got them, I put them on her. So, oh, don't mind her nakedness because um, <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll get into that. Hold on, let me not get ahead of myself. Um, here's the other socks. And then she sent these as well. I really love these. They were on Trinity, but um, I put Trinity's boots back on. So um, yeah, I took them off. Okay, so yeah, that should be it, I think. But um, if there's anything else, I can't remember. Okay, so um, really quickly we get into why she looks like this. Um, so I did a box opening um, like probably like a month and a half ago. I still have the video, I need to post it. But um, so I, I, I bought another one of this body. So this is the same body that Trinity's on. Um, if you didn't know already, she's a uh, lily cat Elena. And she was on the, um, I don't know what it's called, like plum body or something. It's like the really thick body. So about that body is the posing is not really that great. Uh, well, compared to like what I'm used to, like the rest of my crew, the posing is not really great. She wasn't really able to do what um, I wanted her to. So um, I bought this body and then um, put her on it. So I still need to um, color match her. So I, I'm not sure yet if I'm going to paint her like I did Zane or if I'm going to... Um, dye her because last time I tried dyeing it didn't go well but uh, I want to try using a different dye so yeah I'm still not sure if I'm gonna dye her or not but yeah so she's on this body and <laughs> this is not her her bra this is uh, Sienna's bra but um, she's borrowing it because she didn't have any clothes because you know she had the little cat body and um, that body is like really skinny and the clothes were custom made so none of that shit fits on this so uh, yeah all she has is her underwear and these socks and then borrowed bra so um i'm going to be dressing her in this video because i finally got some female clothing because lord knows i needed some so there's still some um, male clothing in here as well but i'm mainly focused on the female clothing because that's really what i was excited about okay so i kind of did a custom order i always do a custom order with cotton honey um, but I also got some things that was part of their, um, shop, or part of their, like, you know, pre-made shop already. So, um, yeah. So I have two orders. This is, like, the custom order plus, like, some extras. And then this was, like, some other stuff I saw. And I was like, oh, I want it. So I, I picked it up. And I'm going to open this one really quickly. Oh, crap. I totally forgot they give you extras and stuff. Okay, so... They're doing this new thing now, I guess, uh, where they're putting um, little, I don't know if this is like a bracelet or a hair tie or something. Um, it's like a hair tie. Cute. Um, and then, huh, this is cute. A uh, sticker, I think, yeah, sticker. And then of course, of course, of course, they're um, the art of their dolls. So I save, every time I get one of these, I save them. So, um, yeah, let me put that to the side. And more of these. I have so many of these. So many. Um, okay, moving on. Oh, I totally forgot about the hangers too. Oh, where's the other one? Oh, I don't know where it is. But yeah, I have like a ton of their hangers. And I've actually been saving them because um, I'm going to be using these types of hangers for the girls. Because the guys, um, like, I mean, they have big hangers too that are like this. But, um... I prefer the guys' clothes to be on the wooden hangers, so I'm going to be using these for the girls because it's like, I don't know, really small. Okay, this is so cute. So I saw this before, but I didn't grab it, um, but then it went up again, so I quickly got it. So I really like this because I feel like this is going to go with her hair because um, you see the purple in her hair. So um, I feel like she looks really good in like white, pink, purple, and like blue colors. So, um, yeah, I really wanted this for her. Let me turn you so you can see her. Yeah, so I wanted this for her. So, 
Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna put this on or maybe I'm probably gonna put this on. And then, oh, this is actually kind of big. Um, well, this is not for her, but this is just something I saw and I wanted it. But um, yeah, this is pretty cute. Um, it's kind of big though. Like, it's really, really big. But I know like, it'll probably sit on um, Sienna really well because she has like that humongous chest. But uh, yeah, it'll probably work on her better because she has those, yeah, those huge knockers. All right, and then, now we're going to go into this bag. Uh, hold on. There's like a bunch of staples. Okay, I'm gonna try to cut myself. Okay, so there is three packages in here. I do not remember what I got, to be honest. So um, this is gonna be kind of fun. Um, I think I think they might be separated. Okay, I don't know what that is. Okay, um, so, make sure there's nothing in here. All right, there's some more hangers. All right. Okay, so this is a cute little, like, crop top, um, sweater. So, yeah, this is for females. So that's cute. Oh, I'm so excited. They finally have clothes. Like, you don't understand. They don't have any, well, didn't have any clothes. Now they do. Okay, and then this little crop top, so cute. And what else? Mm, another little crop top. I'll show you guys these close up, don't worry. I know I'm going through this really fast. Um, so this is for um, the boys. I love this. All right, and then, wait, don't I have this already? I'm pretty sure I have this already. Yes, I do. I know I do. I know I do. There's no way. You know what? I probably have it in like shirt form. Yeah, it's in short form. Okay. So I have the shirt version of this. Yeah, so this is a hoodie. Okay, cool, cool. So I'll still keep it. Um and then this bag. What is this? Oh, this is so cute. I love it when I get little extras like this. This kind of feels like a tattoo. It's all sticky. Okay. Um, so I think this is the custom stuff. All right. More hangers. All right. So um, I wanted I wanted some plain t-shirts or shirts. So um, I wanted a plain gray. Uh, I wanted this kind of to be loose because I wanted this to be like very comfy looking. Um, and she has a pair of jeans. Wherever the hell they are. <laughs> I don't know where they are, but she has like um, jeans that Quaco Creations made her, and I wanted some uh, gray shirt to, um, you know, just make her look at home. And then I also got a matching one for the boys. So yeah. And then um, I wanted this. I had one of these, but I sold it. I think. Yeah, I sold it. But I think the reason why I sold it is because it was it was made for boys. And yeah, so I had one of these for boys, but it wasn't like crop top. It was like a long one and I sold it because, you know, I wanted a girl one. And then same thing, but in black. I'm actually really surprised that these are so big. Like, I don't know, because I know Cotton Honey has like Volks girls and stuff and um, what do you call that? Um, Dolphies, I think. So I'm not too surprised that the clothing is really big, but it shouldn't be too bad. All right, and then here's uh, the final bag. So this is a dress. I think, hold on, Trinity, I feel like the freaking lost this. She's over here. Um, but yeah, I feel like this would look perfect on Trinity. Hold on, she has Zane shacking on. Ugh. All right, let me kind of stand here so you can kind of see. I feel like this would look perfect on her, like perfect, yeah yeah for sure um and then oh look see uh so they had like a little series um it was like see no evil hear no evil and i don't remember what the other one was but uh you know like the i think i don't know what this one is like say no say no or something say no evil 
this one was a C no and then this was the here no evil so yeah I wanted to get the shirts for the boys but um, I never did um, but I saw a dress that had it so I was like let me get the dress this is so cute this is like kittens all right and then um, this um, tank top or not tank top crop top racer um, she actually has um, a checkered skirt so ta-da it'll yeah and then uh, I, I saw this like racer top who, who is this made for like this is so freaking big I think it'll fit if not then it'll have to go to her um, and then this skirt how do you I was actually pretty curious about this oh, okay it's a clasp all right this skirt has like a crane I think this is cute because it couldn't um, match with whatever whoever wears this um, whoever wears this jacket like one of the girls could wear this skirt and then like they could take a picture together and then kind of have like matching concept thing and then another dress like the kiss cats and then um, this shirt is um you know the clones or whatever for the boys so as you can see i was not joking when i said that it was going to be a huge um a huge clothing order thing just the thing was i didn't um i didn't wait because like i was leaving um so if you didn't know i left uh i guess the country yeah i left the country <laughs> uh well i mean i was still i was still near like the coast of florida but um yeah i was no longer in the states because you know i had you know military etc so i was a carrier for a month and um like some of the stuff started to come in before i left and like i was really excited especially for like the hats and stuff so um, i already opened those and i was like you know it's fine like the cotton the cotton honey order is like big already so i already knew that um it wouldn't have made a difference if i just did two different like two separate videos but I didn't post the video of that stuff. So I was like, damn it. So I had to include it in this one. Okay, so I'm gonna just really quickly show you everything close up and then um, I'm going to dress her. So this is this shirt. Um, again, I will um, make sure to leave the links for like the, the stores or where I got these things um, in the description below as I usually do. Um, so do not worry. Okay. So, like, I'm pretty sure, like, 80% of their wardrobe is cotton honey. Like, I've been shopping at cotton honey for, like, um, almost, I want to say almost two years now. I think, yeah, it's, like, it's been almost two years. Maybe it's been two years, I'm not sure. But, um, I always love their stuff. And I support their work because, like, their clothing is really good quality. Um, the price is really nice and affordable. And um, they are very understanding. <clears throat> like, if you want something and they don't have it, you know, just talk to them and see, like, if there's any way they can um, make it or make something similar. Like, I really, really like... Um, I guess seamstresses or artists or whoever creators that like go out of their way to do stuff like that and they are one of those people so I will always support them all right so um that was everything and that stuff over there oh and then this one hoodie thing okay so like I said before I'm going to be dressing Olympia so, I'm gonna just call her Ollie because I don't always say Olympia, I just call her by her nickname. So, take these socks off. Um, so, I bought her some new, um, <laughs> I almost said panties. I bought her some new undergarments. So, um, yeah, those are not probably gonna arrive for like another two, three weeks. But, um, yeah, she's gonna wear this for now. Um, and I'm kind of like indecisive if I should leave her with this hair color. Cause I kind of want to, um, I kind of want to get her, um, a, a all pink, like a hot pink wig. So I actually have some fiber laid out here. 
So like, what, what do you guys think if I like did her hair like this whole, like her whole hair, just this one color? Um, or if I did like a, a gradient or something, like the way her hair is now, but like with this color. Cause like, I don't know, I just feel like that color is really nice. And not that I don't like this color, cause it's really nice too, but I like really want to see her in hot pink. So, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna put this top on her because I really want to see her in this. It's so cute. Um, so she mostly wears skirts, um, but she does have um, she does have some like tights and those jeans, which I need to freaking find. Sorry, keep on moving, you guys. I don't know where the hell I put those jeans. jeans that I was talking about that Coco Creations made her so um she was with Coco for like I don't know like two three months I don't know she was with Coco for a while because um this was around like back in um January January to March when I was like away for a while and I didn't make any videos um so like I, I left them home but I took her to Coco because um remember like the whole lily cat can't wear normal clothes thing so I needed clothes for her so Coco made her these and these this is a set actually um, this is the top half of that set um, it's like a kind of like a I don't know what you call it but anyways I bought like a bunch of like fabric like this I have this in like so many colors and so I wanted um, something made for her and I do not know why I chose this color I should have chose like a pink or something but yeah Anyways, um, I don't know what to put her in. Let me see though if these pants um, fit her because these were made on the lily cat body. And you know, that body's pretty, pretty thick. So I kind of am hoping that these still fit her. Like, I really, really hope they fit her because they look really, really nice. They might look baggy. If they don't fit her, then I'm gonna cry. Okay, they look—they fit her though. They look like um boyfriend jeans. They're like a little loose, but they would look nice with um with like um a sweater or something. Like I I still need to get her um one of those like hand knitted like woven um woven sweaters. But yeah, it still looks nice. It still looks like on the uh, on the little cat body, like it is tight, like in the calf area and everything's tight. But this still looks cute. Like I don't know, what do you guys think? I think it still looks cute. Um, so I need to get her some white shoes. I mean, I already have some white shoes here, but like there's um there's this uh there's these some there's some shoes on um AliExpress that I saw. Um, they're kind of like um I don't know, like I I call them baby doll shoes, but they're not baby doll shoes. But they like like. Kind of like Keds or whatever. I want to get her those because um, I want her to have more white shoes. And then I saw some Uggs that I want to get her too. So her style. Now that I have her, let me talk about her a little bit. Um, her style is like really, um, really soft and casual. Like I feel like everyone else can be like really dressy and I don't know like make a statement when they like wear their clothes or whatever but like she's like her character is like really um really shy easy going and stuff and she doesn't really dress to impress she just wears clothes that are comfortable and so yeah I feel like she just wears like you know jeans and sweaters and hoodies and like I don't know like a sundress or something um or like, I don't know, like, like socks and like a large t-shirt and shorts. Like she doesn't wear anything like super cool, you know what I mean? She just wears like easygoing stuff. So, but this is kind of, this is kind of making a statement though. But I don't care. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to put her in this. 
So um, I kind of tried to avoid putting her in black because I don't know if you noticed, but most of my crew wears black. But um, I don't want her to wear black because, you know, she's supposed to be soft and cuddly. And I feel like black makes her look more... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Black makes her look... Makes her seem like Trinity in them. Like Trinity, like, is like a... She's not a bad girl or anything, but like Trinity is like cool, you know, like she's like one of those cool, cool kids or something. And I don't see um, Ollie that way. I see her as just like, you know, just like a, a, a average girl. So I don't know, just black to me is like color of coolness. <laughs> I, I don't know if that makes sense, but like, yeah, like her in black is just kind of like, it's too much. She's not at that level. Okay. So I'm pretty sure she's gonna look fine in this though. I still don't know if I wanna, I think I might put, I'll try a black skirt on her. Um, Cause I don't feel like the jeans will really go well with this. Um, and if the black skirt doesn't go well, then I'll put on the tights. Cause this, the center part of this shirt is kind of like, it looks kind of like spandex. Um, so I know it's gonna match, like, cause the material looks the same. <sighs> Curse these dainty fingers. Like, their fingers are so, um, so skinny that, like, I always get afraid of breaking them while putting clothes on them. Alright. There you go. Alright, I cannot wait to change, um, her undergarments. So, um, her her new um set of like undergarments are white because once again <laughs> i want her to like be like i don't know soft and innocent so like it's gonna be like uh, a white like not a sports bra but like a lacy type bra and um kind of similar underwear to this but it has lace at the bottom as well um what is the skirt You know what? I don't know about the skirt. I'll still put it on anyways, but I don't think the skirt will really go well with this. I think the um the tights will. Yeah, I don't think the skirt, I mean, it's not bad. See, it looks better if I pull it higher, right? I don't know. It doesn't look bad, honestly. Yeah, it doesn't look bad. But let me try the, um, the tights on, because I think the tights look better. So these are made by Co-Opter Creations as well. Um, I need to get her to make some for the the, um, the doll chateau boys because <laughs> I try to put these on them, but um, they're like too quick. I mean, he has one of them on. I don't know if you can see. Uh, he's like, uh, let me turn a little bit uh, right there. He has one of them on, but like it's so loose. It doesn't look bad, but it's just like really loose, and I want her to make him a custom one. So maybe. So the next year when I get back, I'll commission her. Yeah, see, this looks better. I think this looks better. And it matches like the top. I'll show you. It's super tight though, so you can kind of see the underwear. Oh, look at her little legs. It's so cute. Okay. That looks better. It sucks because I'm gonna have to take all of this shit right off because I have to color match her. But um, yeah, so I think this looks better. I just have to pull it a little bit higher because, you know, kind of looks weird. But yeah, this not look better. I think it looks better. This looks like um, this looks really casual, honestly. Like, even though it's like really nice, like I feel like this is something um that you could wear like out, like 
like not like you know going to the park or something but actually going somewhere that's like where you're gonna be seen like i feel like this is like a nice little outfit um with like if i feel like um your your makeup and hair would really be like the the main attraction but like this is nice like you know shows off your curves and everything um okay so i'm going to put shoes on i don't know will work so <laughs> peep these boots i have not used these not once i think i bought these like three four maybe even five months ago not like there's no crease i have not used these at all so first time for everything we're gonna put these on and hopefully this goes with the outfit it should i mean I, it has a little bit of white but i feel like it, it should be fine so um like I said well, in my other video, but um, this body has six centimeter feet, even though it's an SD. So uh, these are MSD shoes, so I can still fit those, which is why I love this body. Unfortunately, it is discontinued, sadly, so you can't buy it brand new anymore. But, you know, there's still the secondhand market. Mm, these are pretty loose. Oh, look how they slip right on. Should I tuck it in or no? I think I should put this bunch this inside. If I'm bunching the um the tights up so that um you can still see the boots and they don't, they don't cover up the shoes. Oh, this is really cute. You guys are gonna really like this. This is really cute. I really want to see Trinity in that dress, the one with the um, the skulls. But that will be on my own time, cause we are gonna be 40 minutes in by the end of this. These are pretty big, like MSD shoes. Like they're like really loose, and I'm used to like having to fight to get them on. actually those are that, that's awesome isn't it look at her she looks like she's about to go um go to the cemetery <laughs> okay um uh let me put her head back on right. uh i should probably color match her today but i'm so lazy and i have to get a new piece of tape because the old one kind of is worn you guys but like I love a faceplate but I don't trust them so um, I always put a piece of tape to um, make sure that if I, the wig were to uh, accidentally slide off which her wig doesn't at all but still like if it were to slide off or something that this piece of tape would still keep the faceplate connected to the, um, the head cap because I don't want to get a scratch on this beautiful face so yeah okay oh here's a piece of tape by the way and then um, she has double-sided tape on top of her head but she doesn't really need it um, because this wig is like once you put it on after like I don't know I don't know let's say like five minutes it like sticks to the head and it you have to like peel it off but not like peel it off like hard but it's just like it's not it doesn't slide around which i love okay let me put this on i need to curl her hair curl her hair again because um it's the curls have gotten really loose they don't look bad but um it's not like her standard like curly pattern 
come on. All right, there you go. I should have put my gloves on because my hands are kind of like damp and now her hair looks like a bird's nest. <laughs> okay, so I was right. This looks so cute on her. Oh, look at her little eyes. Okay, so this was the dress up video. Um, I'm not gonna comb her hair because I don't ever comb her hair. Like literally, the only time I comb her hair is right before I curl it. So I usually just like um, spray her hair with a water. I just spray it and then um, I pat the, um, the flyaways or whatever you call them. But um, I want her to look all soft and rumpled, so I'm not gonna do that. Um, but yeah, this is her. This is Olympia Ollie. Um, and like I said, I'm probably gonna take this off of her soon because I have to color match her. But um, yeah, I think this outfit is really cute. Let me know what you guys think. Oh, she looks so adorable. I'm so excited. Like they have their own, you know, wardrobe now. Um, I'm still gonna buy them more. So um, yeah, like literally right after I'm done with this video, I'm gonna go on, on um, the shop again and buy some more. But oh, she looks so cute, you guys. She looks really adorable. Hold on. You see it better okay let me do like a close-up slide up I think she looks so adorable all right so that is all for this video so um yeah this was uh, cotton honey um, what was the other one jointed life and then like some random stuff that I got uh, oh, I can't remember the name of the, the shop where I got um, the hats I'm gonna have to do some research for that one because I bought that on Facebook but yeah so that's like that was the stuff um, and that's all I had to show you guys I'm still gonna be making some more videos before I leave next month but um this was this video that I promised you guys um, I'm probably gonna be making I don't know which one so you guys wanted me to review, um, oh, what, what was my question? Oh, okay, it's just Trinity. Um, you guys wanted me to talk, <laughs> wait, I'm so annoyed. You guys wanted me to talk about Zane, so I'll talk about him. He's chilling in the back, um, because I color matched him, and he's on that new body that I got recently. Um, so, yeah, I'll probably make a video about that. And, um, I'll, after I color match her, I'll, I'll do that. And then I also wanted to do, like, um, body review videos so I want to do like some body comparisons so I'll have to act like get everyone naked and do the females and then the males like their own separate video and then I also have to talk about their characters and their styles because I still need to do that so I have quite a bit on my plate right now but I've decided I want to get this video out of the way so I did that so I hope you enjoyed this video um, if you liked, enjoyed, um, you know, like, subscribe, all that mess. And once again, everything will be in the description below. So do not fret. You will be able to find this stuff well, if it's still avail available. Um, and yeah, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave some below. Or you can um, message me on Instagram. My Instagram will be in the description below. And my sales page will be down there as well. So yeah, thanks for watching.